Here we go. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Jorge, hello. How are you, Jorge? Hello, I'm fine. I'm fine. Thank you. And you? Excellent, excellent. Uh, I had a little accident like three minutes ago. But I'm okay. <laughs> there was a minor, minor accident. Yes. Yes. But I'm okay. I'm okay. Thank you for asking. Yes. How was your day? How was your day for him? Okay. Okay. Uh, my day is uh, very um, stressful. Stressful, yes. Stressful, yes. Uh, but, but, in general, okay. All right, all right. But, hi, yes. hi, teacher. Okay. Hi, Carlos. Hi, Good teacher. Evening. Welcome, Carlos. Good evening. Thank you, thank you. What happened? <laughs> We're just here talking. All right. Oh, <laughs> what happened, teacher? How was your day? I was, was, was gay. A very normal oh, okay. day. Okay. A very, a very normal day, yes. I can complain. It was good. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. Right. Okay. Maya, welcome. Yancy and uh, Melanie. Thank you guys for joining today's session. Thank you. I really appreciate your effort and your responsibility. Thank you. People, it's Friday. Are you happy? Oh yes. Oh yeah. But I I I will work tomorrow. So oh, really I'm sorry. Yes. <laughs> me me midday, me ten. Half a day. Half a Four day. Four hours. Half half a day. I think I'm in the chat. Half a day. It means that you're going to work only in the morning or only in the afternoon, or maybe only, only in the morning. Okay, only in the morning. All right. Yes. All right. All right. Excellent. Excellent. Well, um, I am not going to work tomorrow. I only work from a Monday to Friday, so I'm going to be uh sleeping and resting tomorrow and Sunday. Yes. <laughs> Oh, that's good. Good for me. Good for sounds, me. Good for you. Okay. Sounds good. It sounds good. Yes. Yes. What At What least, is What is your hobbies, teacher? My hobbies. Uh, yes. Well, I don't have very yes. very. I don't have very adult hobbies. Uh, I like to watch movies. I like to watch anime a lot. Yeah, that's it. That's what I do. Yeah, and every day, every day I go, I go pick up my baby, my son, and I spend time with my son. That's what I do. Yes. Okay. What have... kind, teacher? What kind of movie do you do you like? I can do many hobbies, but uh, I don't do them very often. You know, I don't do them very often. I sometimes, uh, but play video games but it's not very often i sometimes read books yes but what i do most is watch movies watch series or watch anime yes, that's what i do all right and spend time with my baby of course okay that's good it is good it is good yes <laughs> yes it's my Ernesto. thank you for being here welcome sandra welcome too thank you everyone for being here brian is this joining us? Thank you. Good everyone. evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Welcome. Good evening. Sandra, welcome. Good evening, Good evening, everybody. Welcome, everyone. What a beautiful Friday, yes. <laughs> and I think I'm not really sure about next, next Friday. Uh, apparently, it is going to be a day off, but we don't know. Maybe it's going to be a day off, uh, you know, for, for many people, but not for us, for, for the Cooperativo, since we work online and uh, it's it's pretty simple to join or connect. 
But I will let you know next week, okay? Because I don't really know what is going to happen on on uh, on Friday. Let me take attendance, uh, like most of you are here. Oh, let me tell you that I was checking the platform like one, twenty minutes ago, and uh, I could see, I could notice that some of you have worked, and that's good. Excellent people. Continue working. Today is the last day. The thing is that today I am going to I am going to upload uh the report. That's why. Okay, I do it every Friday uh, after class. Let me see. Let me take attendance. Ana Victoria Galang. No. Okay, Melanie Portillo de Espinosa. Present teacher. Thank you. Brian David Ramirez. Present. Thank you, Brian. Uh, let me continue. Carlos Alberto Orrego. Present teacher. Thank you, Carlos. Carlos Eliezer Dimas Soriano. This one, okay. Denise Alejandra Zuniga. Diana Yamilet Maravilla Navas. No. Edith Adilia Hernandez. Present. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ismael Ernesto Boyar. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Jorge Ernesto Hernandez Durán. Present teacher. Thank you. Mayra Elizabeth Lazo Escobar. Present teacher. Thank you, Mayra. Rafael Alejandro Morales Ávila. No. Raquel Elizabeth de la Rosa Rodríguez. Sandra Ives Mendoza de Flores. Present teacher. Thank you, Sandra. Sara Rachel Salazar. No, not yet. And Jancy Andrea Solorzano Castro. Present teacher. Thank you, Jancy, for being here. Ana Victoria, welcome. Aquí actualizo, permítame, ya la, ya la vi. I saw you already. Hi. Okay, very good. We are more than ready. Let me see if somebody sent me a text over here on WhatsApp. Uh, it's not connecting. Let me see. Okay. We're fine. Okay, people. Today, there is a lot to do. Today, we're going to review. We're going to review unit number one. We're going to have the review of unit number one. And there is a lot to practice. There are many exercises to do. And, uh, well, we're going to start right now. And let's start by quickly reviewing yesterday's topic. Let me make this bigger. Okay. Uh, this is class number five or day number five. Uh, we say we say goodbye to June today. Tomorrow we start a new month, right? So goodbye to June. It's been good. It was good. A good month. Let's continue. Can you tell me a little bit about yesterday's topic? Do you remember, people? The topic that we were practicing, studying uh, yesterday. Refresh my mind, please. I want to remember or, uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, we talk about the shipping label. Excuse me, can you repeat that again? We talk about the shipping label. Okay, shipping label, yes, exactly, exactly, yes. And we actually we actually created one shipping label, or at least we tried to do one. Yes. What else? What else do you remember about yesterday? Guys, what else do you remember? Simple future be going to. Okay, simple future using be going to. All right. 
Do you remember? Do you remember what we exactly study about simple future? Like structures. No. Okay. Uh, and yes, we were studying. Uh, be going to yesterday. We were studying the affirmative sentences or statements, negative statements, yes, no questions, and also WH questions, okay? And uh, to practice, to practice a little bit or to refresh our minds, we're going to do this. I'm going to ask you questions randomly, okay? I'm going to ask you questions randomly, and of course, you're going to answer the questions, and that's how we are going to practice or refresh our minds on be going to. Let's begin with you, Ana Victoria. Ready? Okay. Yes. A very, very easy question. What time are you going to sleep tonight? What time are you going to sleep tonight? Uh, I sleep in... I am going to sleep um twelve o'clock. <laughs> Too late. Yes, every day. <laughs> twelve a.m. Wow. <laughs> okay. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you for the answer. For your answer, Sandra. Hi. Okay. I got a question. I got a question for you, Sandra. The question is, what are you going to cook tomorrow morning? What are you going to cook mm -hmm. tomorrow morning? Let me check. I'm going to cook uh, lasagna. Okay. I am going to cook lasagna. Very good. Very good. Good plan. Good plan. Well, people, let me tell you. I have never, I have never eaten lasagna. Never. <laughs> Never in my white life. teacher. Really, oh. teacher? No, you don't I like. Don't believe. I, you don't I like. Haven't, oh. I haven't had the opportunity. That's that's why. Like I have gone to. You don't like. Rest. You don't like the pasta, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a pasta fan. Like no. The the teacher there. Uh, there are uh, there are uh, all all no. kind of uh, lasagna. For example, uh, lasagna or lasagna uh, chicken with chicken, lasagna with carne, with meat, mm, and I don't good. believe don't I don't believe I don't believe it. <laughs> that <laughs> you're like I haven't had the opportunity. That's why. <laughs> maybe, okay. maybe, okay. maybe soon. Maybe soon. Yes. Okay. Excellent. Well, Carlos, with you, Carlos. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me. Answer this question. Who is going to supervise your company? Who is going to supervise your, your company? Um, uh, I, I going to supervise. I go. I am, to supervise. I am going to. I, I am going to supervise my company. Okay, I am going to supervise my company. Sounds like a very very good idea. Let me continue with Jorge. Jorge. Yes. Okay, the question Tell for me. you is the question for you is why are you going to watch the game? Why are you going to watch the game? I'm going to watch the game because I very interesting about the competition. Okay, I am very I am very interested in the competition. In the competition. Okay. Yes. Okay, interested in. Ese, ese interested, ese interested in ya va junto siempre. Okay, no, usa, no usamos on, no usamos about, siempre se usa interested in. Yes. Inter interesado en. Yes. Okay, very good, very good. Thank you, Jorge, for your participation. Let's continue. Ismael. Hi. Listen to this question. Who are you going to write an email to? 
Ooh. Am I going to write an email to? Okay, um, I'm going to write an email to the human resources manager. Okay, to the human resources manager is, is a good answer. Thank you for answering. Uh, Raquel Elizabeth. Raquel. No. Let me try with uh, Mayra Elizabeth. Hello, teacher. Yes, your question is, what are you going to read? I am going to read uh, a book of... Um, I don't know. Um, Receta de cocina. Oh. Cooking recipe. Cooking recipe, you say a, you can for say example. A, a cooking book. Okay, a cooking book. Or a recipe, recipe book. Recipe a book. Recipe, recipe book, okay. Okay, thank you for your answer. Uh, let me see, Melanie, are you ready? Melanie? Yes. Your question, yeah. your question is very easy. When are you, when are you going to call the secretary? Let me repeat yes. it. When, when are you going to call the secretary? Yes, teacher. Hello. Yes. Yes, your question is when when are you going to call the secretary? I am going to the secretary in the office. Mm -hmm. I am going es un plan futuro. Es que no lo entendí, teacher. Sorry. The question is when. When is cuando? When are you going to call the secretary? Call. People, what is call? Call, yes, yes. Okay. Llamada. Yes. <laughs> yes. Who are you? Go Sorry. When are you going to call the secretary? Uh, when when uh, attention client so you have to answer i am going to i am going to uh, attention the verbo sí, um, speak no no who, sorry, when are you going to call the secretary? Juan lo llamará a la secretaria. I am going to call mm -hmm. the secretary. The secretary. Yes. Today. Yeah, today is, is good. Today is good. Yes. Works, it works. Thank you, Melanie, for your answer. Today, tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, today, tomorrow, next week, next month, next millennium. <laughs> it's fine. Yes. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Let's continue. Let's continue with uh, someone else. Let me see, Jancy, Andrea. Okay, I think she's not there. Diana, Yamilet. Good night, teacher. Hi. Good evening. Tell me, why are you why are you going to speak in the conference? Uh, 
Why are you going to speak in the conference? Um, I won't. Mm -hmm. I want to uh, speak the conference in the in the morning. In, in the what, sorry? In the morning. No, morning. No, but I said, morning. I said why? 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 I asked why. Why are you going to, excuse me, why are you going to speak in the conference? I'm going to speak the conference in. Speak in the conference? In, in the conference. Uh -huh. um, in the morning, in the morning. No, no. Because, es por qué, por qué. Why? Why? Ah, okay. Um, the bueno, I'm going to the conference. Speak in uh, the conference. For the presentation. No sé cómo es pronunciado. No, sé. no, no. Because. ¿Por qué? Okay. Yes. <laughs> You can say because because it's my duty. It is my duty. Thank you, duty. It is no no duty. It is my duty. Go to the chat. You're gonna find expression there. It is my duty. It means es mi responsabilidad. Okay. Okay. Re repeat, it, Diana. Okay. I'm going to uh, the conference and I'm uh, responsible. Okay, because it is my responsibility or because I am responsible. Yes. Okay, yes. works. Thank you, everyone. We're going to continue because uh, there's one more thing I want to show you. Not this one. It's here. We're going to finish, finish the practice with going by doing a very easy activity. This is the activity. Look, one, two, three, four, five, up to 10. And we're going to come up. We're going to come up. Sankes, come up. I think I chat. Excuse me, come up with. In the chat, come up with. No? Ben, Ben. Es como, como inventar, crear, generar, okay? That's what it is. That's what it is. So. We are we are going to come up with examples uh by taking by taking a look at the pictures. Okay, so the, the, the example is going to be, or you're going to use this icon or picture as a reference to come up with the example. First, number one, you see a clock there or alarm or whatever, a clock. He is going to get up at six o'clock, okay. It is related to the picture or to the icon. All right, people, let's continue. Let's do from number two to number 10. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, and 10. You have the, the drawing, the icon, or the picture there, and you're going to write example down here. Okay, do you have any questions? No questions? No. Okay, fantastic. Yes, like I told you, today we are going to practice a lot, okay? It's review. We have review, so we're going to be doing a lot of exercises, okay? Yes. Go ahead. If you have any questions, I am here.
teacher. Yes. And the number four, uh, I don't, I don't Thank see, I, I don't see well the, 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 I don't see well the drop, the drop. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it? it's fruits, it's fruits. Ah, okay. I see, well, not fruits entirely. I see this a carton ah. of milk, uh, okay. bananas. Uh, okay, thank you. I think it's like healthy, healthy food or something like that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, yes. Number six, teacher, sorry, uh, is a bookstore. Uh, bookstore, oh, okay. Yes. Okay. It's a bookstore. Are you guys ready? Who is not ready yet? Who's not ready? 
I'm ready. I'm ready to chill. You ready? Yeah. Guys, what about you? Are you guys ready? I think you are. Okay. Let's begin. Let's begin. Uh, number two, we have the cup and copy over there. Let me see. Mayra, what do you have in number two? Uh, so number two, my mother is going to drink a cup of coffee. Okay, my mother is going to drink a cup of coffee is a good example. Fantastic example. Yes, thank you, Mayra, for your participation. Diana, hi. Hi, teacher. The second one, the second one. El mismo. Okay. Uh, do you want to go for a coffee? Mm. Me quedo congelado. Sí. <laughs> no. Uh, uh, tiene que ser, um, tiene que ser todo, todo el futuro, todo el futuro. Going, going. Okay. Sería, I sería, go... are you... Are you going to? Si es pregunta. Okay. Are you going to for uh, the coffee? And what about the verb? El verbo faltó. Okay. Are you going um, want to go for um, a drink the coffee? Mm. Maybe, maybe, maybe are you going to drink a cup of coffee? But are you going to want? Are you going to want? Es como dirías, vas a querer? Vas a querer beber? Are you going to want? Mm, okay. okay. But it's okay. Thank you for your participation, Diana. Thank you for the example. Let's continue with Anna. Anna, read number three. Um, the number three, we are going to practice swimming. Okay, we are going to practice swimming. Fantastic. Thank you very much for that. Let's continue with Brian Ramirez. Okay, Brian is not there. Raquel Elizabeth. Yeah, teacher. I'm here. Oh, Brian. Thank you, Brian. Uh, read number three, yeah. please. Number three. Yeah. Yes. I'm going to swim tomorrow with my friends. Okay. I am going to swim tomorrow with my friends. Say it again. I am going to swim with my friends tomorrow. Yes. Okay. Uh, Raquel, Elizabeth. Let me try with Edith. Edith? Um, the fourth one, number four, Edith. Four. Four. Yes, number four. Um, today, today we are going to eat healthy. Okay, today we are going to eat healthy. Yes. Today we're going to eat healthy. Oh. Raquel has a microphone problem. I am sorry, uh, Raquel. Like, you should try to fix it. It's like, cada, cada laptop, bueno, mi laptop trae como tres micrófonos. Bueno, así estos tres. Pero aparece la opción en, 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 le dice el, no está el icono del micrófono, le dan clic a la flechita y aparecen varias opciones ahí. Dice alta voz y micrófono. Aquí me aparecen tres, tres opciones a, a mí. Ok, a veces no funciona una. Por ejemplo, acá, si le pongo esto. Hello, hello. No me escuchan, ¿verdad? ¿Me escuchan? Yes, teacher, I can yes. hear you. Ok, entonces se funciona. Ah, no, es otra cosa puse, otra cosa le, le cambié acá. Es uno de estos que no funciona. Queda un uno, no sé por qué. Pero igual, ustedes, ustedes ahí, cualquier, vean las opciones. Y... The, the, other, the other microphone, teacher said. Ajá, yes. It's, 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 more, it's best, it's best. Y si se ponen audífonos, pueda que ese, esos audífonos eh, limiten el, el uso del de micrófono. Okay. 
it it's also a problem but it's okay yes don't worry don't worry uh raquel take it easy okay take it easy <laughs> yes all right we were here let's continue with number four the same number four go and give us your example for him number four Hello, number four, okay? Yes, yes. Um, my family and I are going to, we are going to uh, eat a little food. Okay, why, Healthy why, food. Why? <laughs> okay, <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Fantastic, fantastic. Hey, take me with you. Give me food. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Jorge, for your example. Let's continue, guys. Let me try with Jancy. Jancy, Andrea? Hi, teacher. Number five. Five, 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 five. Are you going to copy the computer? Are you going to use, usar? Use. Use, okay. Okay. Yes, are you going to use the computer? Yes, exactly. Excuse me. Thank you, Yancy, for an example. Maida, continue, Maida, with the number five. Hello. 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 Number five. Hello. Hello, teacher. Me escucha? Hello. Can you guys hear me? No me escucha, ¿verdad? Sí. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello. Hello. ¿No me escuchan? Yes, teacher. Hello. Yes, yes, teacher. We can hear you, teacher, and... Oh, Mayra. Mayra, me In Mayra, I can hear you, Mayra. Teacher, now... I think, I think, I think Mayra can, can, can hear you. Hello, hear us. Number five. Yes, number five. Number five. Okay. Jose is going to repair repair my computer okay jose is going to repair repair okay repair my computer repair. okay thank you thank you myra for your participation melanie read number six number six is computer teacher number six Yes, here with the bookstore. I am going to work on the computer. No, no, number number six. Six, acá está. The computer is number five. Uh, six, veo yo, teacher. <laughs> no, sí, sí. Es una, es una, es una. How do you say bookstore in Spanish, people? Come on, Libre. Libre. Yes. <laughs> it happens sometimes. I get confused. So, Melanie, your example is going to be related to bookstore. I am going to um, buy boy, buy book. Okay, I am going to buy a book. Okay, a book. or I am going to buy books. Oh, yes, yes. People, we have we have uh, some time limitations, so we're going to stop with that activity, and we're going to continue with some activities we have in the book. Let me share the book with you guys, and we're gonna see what we will be doing. Close some uh, things here that I don't, I don't need. Okay, there you go. 
Okay, if you go to page number 17, on page number 17, well, let me take you back. Uh, yesterday we were talking about going, as you know, we did this part number five and we did this part number six. We even presented the activity, we did everything, so it was good. So we're going to continue on page number 17 and on page number 17, we have the first activity and it is vocabulary practice. Find eight words about product features and write them on the lines. Yes. Over here in this uh, activity, we have eight words hidden. Hidden. Escondidas, okay, hidden. Ocultas. En el chat lo puse la palabra. Hidden. hidden. Ocultas, escondidas. Okay, the words are hidden in the activity here in the... In the Letter two. You have to find. You have to find the words, and you have to write the words over here. Okay, I'm going to give you a couple of minutes to this activity, people. It's difficult to see the the, the letters. Let me see if. Yes. Let me see if this improves. If I if I uh, zoom this in, veamos si lo si le pongo un poquito de zoom. Se ve mejor. I don't know, it's English edition. Se ve lo mismo, ¿verdad? Pero sí, dejamos los dos. Bueno, creo que más, más o menos sabemos qué letras son. W, este no sé qué es. A ver, aquí. Tipo, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead. Find the words, find the words. Have you found any word? Nothing? <laughs> None? <laughs> well, Only I one. found ways. Only one. Only one? I don't see. <laughs> yes. It's okay, it's okay. People over here, Ino Sulatang is very hot right now. Hot, hot. Which word have you found? Tell me the word. In that way, I can write it down right here in number one. What is the word or what are the words you have, guys? Feature um, is so difficult because the letter are uh, are some pixel pixels. Yeah. yeah, I know, I know. No distinct. You cannot really really see see what the word is exactly. It's difficult to see. I mean, the letter, the letter is difficult to see. Feature, there are um some. Topic 
or it's about the class in general? Yes, it's about the class. It's a, in fact, it's about the first class that we had on Monday. The first class, and it is the first, no, excuse me, the second, the second activity in the first uh, or page number nine. Yes. But I cannot tell you, it's, it is cheating. <laughs> you have to refresh your minds. If you go back to the book, you're cheating. There is in, in, in the book? Yes, yes. What, what page teacher? Remember, remember, this is a review. Let me check. Ah, okay, let me check. You're gonna find, you're gonna find all the information on page number nine or 10. I think okay. it's nine. Teacher, why is this one of the words? Which one? Wait. Yes, it is one. It is one. Okay. Of them. Did you find it? I find that the the H H word in the in the page number nine. Ah. We review in the in the <laughs> we review in the and the Thursday. We I have think. one. <laughs> we have found one. Hemos encontrado una. Acá está. Bueno, Ismael found it. Here, here, here. Look. Other word is fun function. Or function. Can you tell me where the word is? Function. Or function. Yes, function, but where is the word? In, in the... In the book, game. <laughs> no, it, it's in the... <laughs> Don't expect me that. I cannot see the word. I don't find it. In the four row. Uh, One, two, three, four. Five column. Thank you, Carlos. Uh, he found fries. Yes. Where is function? I don't see it. Oh, I got it. Thank you, Victoria. <laughs> I got it. Yes. People, we got it over here. Look. Continue, mm -hmm. guys. Tell me, tell me where you find them. Okay, so far, so far, we have, so far we have three. The name was weight. We got price. And we got function. Battery life in the last column. I don't see the difference. Which word is that one? The, Battery oh, life. The dimension. Dimension. Thank you. Thank you. It is not, it's not that it's, 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 uh, let me show you from here. D. Dimension. That's the, the other one. Gar guarantee. Oh, guarantee. Dimension. What? The we warranty. Warranty. Where is it? Let me stop. Where is the word warranty? In the. Okay. In the second row, second row, mm -hmm. eight column. Okay. Yeah. No. Which one is W? Well, In the second, the second row, mm -hmm. eight column. Got it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Okay.
small crown, a tiny crown. Warranty, okay? This is Garantia, warranty. Okay, we still we still have to find, we need to find size. A storage. Storage. Oh, a storage. Storage, and uh, there's one more. That we it's, need to find. In the... What is the other one? What la otra? La otra Which one is missing? Battery life. Okay, battery. Battery life. There you go. Battery life. Okay. Now battery. we need to find we need to find the words. I can control the palabras. We need to find them. Can you tell me? It's the storage is in the first column. Mm -hmm. And uh, storage. I found battery life. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Okay, thank you, thank you. Here <laughs> Thank you, Anna. I don't see the word, Anna. Show me. In the first column. In nine row, first column. In the left. We got size. Hmm. The last one, why you go? I don't know. There you go. We have found all of them. Storage is right here. Okay. There you go. You have all the words weight, price, dimension, sorry, function, dimensions, warranty, size, and storage. I'll give the whole guarantee. También existe esa palabra. Sí. Tenemos warranty. Rápidamente tengo que hacer la diferencia para que sepan que, que son diferentes, un poco diferentes. Lo que es es warranty, 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 then we see. No puedo del spelling. Ok, do you know the difference? Does anybody know the difference? Warranty, guarantee. Warranty, guarantee. Is the pronunciation warranty and warranty and guarantee? Warranty and warranty. So you're suggesting that the pronunciation is a difference. People not having. Okay, let me show you. The first one, warranty, in Spanish, es un sustantivo. Okay, garantía. And gu guarantee, that one is, let me see. Okay, yeah. Solo una aire nomás. Así es. Okay. Guarantee significa garantizar, prometer. Okay, that's the difference. It's the okay. verb for the action. Prácticamente es como, como la, la acción de, de garantía, le garantizo que este objeto o le prometo que este objeto. I, gu I guarantee this product will be just fine. Okay. And warranty, the, 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 warranty, warranty is the document. Warranty. Con w. The document. Okay. La otra es gu. No es wa. Go. The first one, the first one, wa, warranty. Warranty and gar guarantee. La que está con G es ga, guarantee. Ga. Guarantee, yes. Okay, guarantee. Okay. Noun and verb. Yes. Okay. Very good. What? Sorry. I ended up losing me with thing right here. Okay, we finished this one. Let's continue. And we got this one. Part number two is right here, down here. I'm sorry. It says vocabulary practice. Ahora, we're going to take 
we're going to take three, three words, three words from the eight words, size, dimension, function, weight. You're going to choose only three of them. You're going to choose only three of them, and you're going to choose three products. Or let me show you what you're going to do. You're going to do something similar to this, okay? You're going to do something similar to this. Acá hemos elegido tres. We have chosen weight, we have chosen dimension, and we have chosen quantity. You can choose other features or other characteristics, no problem. You can choose others. And you are also you are also going to choose three three uh three things, three objects, okay, to do the activity down here. Look at it. Over here, I'm going to give you an example. Picture, for example, I can write over here printer. Okay, printer. And over here, I can write the features or characteristics of the product. Here is the printer. Printer, and then I can write over here weight. Excuse me. Weight. I can write over here function. Function. And you can write something different, like model. Okay, model or even a brand, okay? That's what you can do. And uh, you're gonna choose the products, printer, let me choose another one, keyboard. I guess keyboard. Keyboard, okay, and uh, a hard disk, hard, hard disk. Tenemos el teclado y tenemos hard disks son discos duros. Okay. Yes. That's what we're going to do. Okay. Do you understand the activity? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. Let's yes. do it. Let's do it. Let's do the activity. Again, this part over here, la parte de arriba, is, that one is free. It is free. You can choose whatever, whatever picture you want. Okay. You can use size, you can use quantity, you can use uh, others, okay? So I'm going to give you a couple of minutes to do this.
teacher, I have a doodle. Uh -huh. Um, in the in the column in the first column. Yep. I think that can uh, put put in the future and the route the product. I mean, you mean you mean backwards or reverse? Is there? You are you are uh, bright. The future and the route. Yes. I'm sorry. You are bright. The future. In the route. In the color green. No. I don't understand. No le comprendo. <laughs> okay. Es que vaya. Eh, bueno, mi lógica. <laughs> en la columna vamos a escribir las características y en la fila el producto los productos no puede ser al revés yeah. It's okay. Ah, okay. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> don't worry Good. People, are you finished? Almost teacher. Okay. Almost? Okay, yes, almost. I finished teacher, but yes, I don't teacher. know. It's, thank you, thank you. It's, it's correct. It's okay, it's okay. We are going to see if it is correct in a couple of minutes. Yes. How do you say centimeters in English? 
Centímetros. Centímetros. Ah, centímetros, centímetros. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> okay. Okay, centímetros. Okay, let's begin, people. Let's begin sharing. Let me see. I need a volunteer, a voluntario. Uh, me, teacher. Okay, Carlos, go ahead. Share your activity. Uh, hey, I I chose three uh, three words. There is a uh, size, battery, battery life, and and warranty. Okay. And warranty. Yes. Uh, the first product is cellular. Uh, size uh, ten centimeters. Uh, battery life in, in infinity is uh, one hundred percent, and the uh, warranty is of one to two years. Okay. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, the order, the order, the, the second product is tablet. Okay. Uh, size uh, um, fifty. Uh, uh, yeah, see, fifty cent, uh, fifty centimeters. Um, battery life is uh, one hundred percent, and warranty of one to three months. And uh, electric uh, electric car uh, size is approximately uh, four me uh, four meters, and low bat uh, battery. Life uh one hundred percent and warranty of one to four years. Okay, okay. Just the first thing uh is cell phone. Okay, you say cellular. Okay, <laughs> cell phone, cell phone. Yeah. cellular. Cell phone. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank you, Carlos. Uh, cell phone. Sorry, cell phone. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Carlos, for sharing. Okay. Let's continue with another person. This time it is going to be a girl. And the girl is. We got it. Me, teacher. Oh, okay. thank you. <laughs> and in the future is a product in external hard drive. No, it's yes, yes. Um, the weight is zero. Point three pounds. And the function is for information storage. And the brand is Seagate. Do you understand? <laughs> okay. Okay. Other. Other products. Another product, yes. Another product. And the other product is a uh, um, cell phone. And um, the weight is zero point two pounds. Um, the function is for make calls. In the model Samsung, in excuse. The model, the brand is Samsung e model A32. Okay. It's all. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's okay, Victoria. Thank you for your participation and thank you for sharing your examples. Let me continue with another person and that person is uh, Brian. Are you done with the activity?
Okay, Brian is not there. Let me try with uh, Sandra Ibre. Okay, Jessica. 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 In the printer and the weight can be ten pounds, and the function uh, can scan, copy, and print. print. Um, yes, print and use the, the Wi-Fi connection. And the model brand can be. HP canning rectum. Okay. Do you have another one? And the uh, hard disk, the weight is five pounds, and the function can be storage information and has 500 terabytes. And the model or brand is uh, Fujitsu. You say you say there are five hundred terabytes. Yes. <laughs> That's a lot of storage, people. <laughs> yes. I think it doesn't even exist. No existe, verdad? Ya sé que no tiene dos terabytes. Está muy avanzado. Ah, creo que el que he visto es de cinco terabytes nomás. No sé si más, pero I don't know. That's a lot of information. That's a lot of it's it's storage. Like you will never, you will never like like use it up. Use use it up. And in fact, use up. It's a phrase verb. Use up significa gastar. Ahí está. Como gastar los zapatos, camisas que se van destruyendo poco a poco. That's use up. Okay. Very good. Let's continue. Let me see that. Sandra, thank you very much for sharing. Uh, let me see. Ismael. Go, oh, Ismael. Don't worry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Sorry. Um, well, I use printer, keyboard, and hard disk. And the features, dimension, warranty, and function. Mm -hmm. For printer, dimensions are 14 centimeters per 30 centimeters per 47 centimeters. And the warranty is six months. And the, the function is print color and black and white prints. Document. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the keyboard, the dimensions are 30 centimeters per 15 centimeters. The warranty is for three months. And the function is write digital words in the computer. I, I don't know how, how it says. And the last one, hard disk, the dimensions are a that five per eight that five centimeters and the warranty is one year and the function is store all the documents in the computer okay fantastic thank you very much for sharing ismael excellent excellent thank you all right let me see <clears throat> Melanie. share only one only one one uh product or material or service, only one. Okay, um, printer in weight 30, hello, teacher se me olvidó, <laughs> numero tres. Three. <laughs> It's okay, it's okay. Suele pasar. It happens, it happens. 13 and 12. 14. Libra stitch. Pounds. Pounds. Yes. Six. 
sí, kil, kilogramos, no sé cómo se dice. Kilo, kilograms. Kilograms. Function, function de printer, scan, copy, main, store and print document, and model brand, inject printers, laser printers, and LED printers. Different model teacher. Okay. All right, all right. We got it, we got it. You got it. Thank you for sharing. Let me see someone else. Edith, are you there? She's not there. Raquel? Yeah, no, okay. They're not there. Let me try with Jorge. Jorge? George. I'm sorry, teacher. I have troubles with connections. Okay. So you cannot participate right now? Right now? No, I'm sorry. Okay. It's okay, it's okay, don't worry, don't worry, I understand. Okay, people, don't worry, okay? We're going to stop here. Remember, this is just a practice, okay, a review. We're going to continue and I wanna show you or remind you of, remind you of nouns. Do you remember the nouns, people? Nouns. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now. I also remember that. <laughs> okay, remember, we have count nouns and we've got. Kind of. No, kind of. Exactly. We've got non. Excuse me. Non count nouns. That's it. We have two types of nouns in Spanish, English, in every language. Yes. Okay, count nouns, remember. Count nouns, you can say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can continue counting up and no problem. Non-count nouns, on the other hand, they are different. They do not have a plural form. Let's focus on non-count nouns. Enfoquémonos un poco solamente en non-count nouns. Que son los que más complican en el aprendizaje de cualquier idioma. Cualquier idioma uh, confunde un montón estas cosas, los nouns. Ok, first off, food. ¿Cuáles son las categorías? Well, food. Ok, we got food, we got drinks. People, remember, all drinks, all drinks are non-count nouns. Todas las bebidas o líquidos son nombres o cosas no contables. Ok. Sugar. So, okay. that sugar. Was La, eso aplicaría como en comida. Water. I think. Yeah. Uh, another thing here. What's the word? Uh, subjects. ¿Saben qué son subjects? Subjects. No. Materias. Asignaturas. Ah, okay. Yes. Abstract. Teacher, sorry. And the 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 stars of the sky is uh, will be a uh, no count. The, no the clouds. The clouds. Clouds. Yes. Se puede. Es que In the rain. The let rain. Me show, let me show you some. Let me tell you something here. Algunas cosas en inglés son lógicas y algunas no son lógicas. Let me tell you why. Por qué. Según la lógica del inglés, no se puede contar. Feeling. No se puede contar el arroz. Ay, no, sí se puede contar las estrellas y los frijoles. Entonces, no tengo... y, y, y como que, ¿qué pasó? Entonces, el arroz no se puede contar, pero sí podemos contar las estrellas que son infinitas y eh, los frijoles. Super <ríe> yeah. so, no, the grain of salt. Of salt. Sugar, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. The feeling. Hello. Hello. Words. The feeling. 
Oh yes, feelings. Feelings or emotions. Emotion, feelings and emotions. Uh what else? The hair. Okay, we got those uh amorphous yeah. words. Low tissue. I'm gonna show you what they are. Okay. Well, what is amorphous feature? I'm gonna explain that to you right now. Okay. Food. Okay. I'm going to give you some examples of food. No todas las comidas pueden contarse, okay? Algunas se pueden contar, algunas no se pueden contar. Things that we cannot count. Cosas que no se pueden contar de comida. Let me give you a list. We have uh, meat. Okay, no, meat, no. Chicken. Chicken. Beans se pueden contar. Yes. Oh, rice. No, okay. Arroz se puede contar. Sugar. Sugar, beans. Part of the beans. Salt, <laughs> and there are many more. I muchas más. I muchas más. Butter, que es mantequilla. Many things that are related. Oil. Oil. Sauce. Oil. Okay. And we have a lot of words. Water. And drinks, we got water. We got. Milk. Sorry. Milk. Milk. Whiskey with milk. Whiskey. Milk. Coffee. Wine. How do you say your chata? Beer. It's probably fresh water. Fresh water, but oh, or chata. It's a proper noun. Sun. It's Sun. a proper noun, yes. I'm sorry? Sun, teacher. Which one? Sun. Oh, arena. Arena? Yes. Sí, pero no, estamos en, en bebidas ahorita. <ríe> yes. oh, okay. It's okay. Pero sí. Beer. Hey, no. It is Friday, people. Beer. Yeah. Beer. Oil. <ríe> beer. <ríe> okay. Beer. Subjects, Oil. Subjects. Uh -huh. Subjects we got English. No se puede contar en inglés. English. What else? Math. Um, Math, um, art. social language. Okay, I'm sorry. Language. Uh, English, uh, biology. Biology. Play. Science, etc. Hay muchas más. Entonces, la materia no se puede encontrar tampoco. Abstract nouns, happiness. So I guess happiness. You know what happiness is? Felicidad. Felicidad. Exactly. Sadness. What is sadness? Tristeza. Mm -hmm. Evidence. Evidence. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Exactly. Exactly. Yes. What else? Uh, uh, darkness. Sorry? Head. Reason. Darkness. I'm sorry, repeat it, Research. man. Search. Oh, dar darkness. Darkness. Dark darkness, yes. Darkness. All right. Sports. Tennis. Football. Mm -hmm. Volleyball. Basketball. Ball, basketball. Baseball. 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 And the soccer people. The most important. Soccer. <laughs> the most important. Okay. Feelings and emotions. What about this one? Feelings and emotions. Okay. Angry. Okay. Anger. Anger. Tired. Some. Sad. Hungry. Bored. Yeah. 
Por no, sad. Sad. no, sad no. No. Esos son adjetivos. Oh, they're adjectives. Okay. And the last one, amorphous. Do you know what this is? It's uh, words that are like, for example, snow, rain, smoke, oops, gas, gasoline, and we got a lot of them, oxygen. Okay, what we have here is uh, the most, the most common, the most common categories of non-town nouns. Son las categorías más comunes de nombres o sustantivos no contables. Okay, ahí tenemos el listado de categorías con algunos ejemplos. Hay muchos más, hay muchos más. Okay, pero acá unos cuantos. Preguntas, questions, people. Questions? Yes, what it means? Tiresome. Tiresome, cansancio. Oh. Yes, cansancio, that's what it is. And anger? Anger. Uh, enojo. Anger. Enojo? Yeah. Enojo. Sí. I, I, think, I think tiresome, no es así. Es sin la, sin la, sin la de. Perfect. Okay. Excellent. We're going to continue, guys, and let me show you the next activity. It is related to count nouns and non count nouns. The activity is this one, number three. It says in the indication, it says countable versus uncountable nouns. Write a question. Escribe una pregunta. Write a question to match each answer. Okay. Escribe una pregunta para emparejar o emparejarla con cada respuesta. Question, uh, the answer here is, I have 50 boxes of thread. You are going to give me the question. Las preguntas van a ir con how many y how much, people. How many, how much. Okay. Yes. Ready? Go. Let me get some water. Okay, teacher. Give me a minute. Thank you. Thank you. Give me a second. I'll take a little bit of water. Okay, okay. A little bit of water. Teacher. Teacher. Está tomando agua. Yes, I'm, I'm back. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, teacher. Um, uh, and the number one, why is thread? Mm -hmm. T -H uh, yes, kilo. Kilo, okay. Okay, okay. Thank you. You are welcome.
Are you close to finishing? Not yet, teacher. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. We have time. Guys, are you ready? Are you done? Yes, uh, yes. Yes? Okay, everyone is done. I done. <laughs> Let's begin. Let's begin. Uh, let me see. Let me try with the uh, Jancy Andrea. Uh, 
Okay, that is not there. Let, let's continue, Myra. Myra, Myra. Hello, hello, teacher. Okay. Number one, read read the question and then read the answer. Mm -hmm. How many mm -hmm. boxes of street do you have? How many boxes of thread do you have? have. Okay. Does anybody have a different lead? <laughs> Does anybody have it differently? No, it's the same. Me only, how many threads do you have? Mm, okay, how many threads do you have? Okay, it is this thread, thread is a noun. Es el thread es un, es un sustantivo. Thread is a non count noun. No se puede contar thread. No se puede contar el hilo. Se puede contar el rollo, la caja, el paquete. Mm. But not the thread. Okay, so. The question is correct. How many boxes of thread do you have? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Well, Sandra. Yes, Sandra. The second one. The second, whether have they cleaning? Sorry. What are how they clean? No, no. Oh. How many floors? How many floors they clean it? No. Say it will be like this. Well, let me see. Uh, how many? How many floor cleaners? Do you, do they, sorry, do they have? How many, how many floor cleaners do they have? What is a floor cleaner, people? Hold on, I want to sneeze. Ah, uh, sorry. Hi. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, don't worry. <laughs> It's okay, Sandra, don't worry. Okay, let's continue with someone else. That someone else is Edith. Are you there? Could you read number three? Uh, <clears throat> how many gallon of gasoline do you add, do you add need for the lead? Okay. Yes, yes. Solo que, que dijo do you, y no es do you, sería does he. Does he. Uh, La respuesta es does. he. So we have, he. excuse me, wait, wait. Okay. How many How gallons, many? Está bien, todo está bien, many gallons. Uh -huh. Many gallons. Gas. Gasoline. Or, or the, gas, gas. That's do you que me dijo perdón? Do sorry, does does he need does need for the lift? How many gallons? How many gallons of gas for the lift? For the lift does he need? Okay. Okay. Yes, that's what it is. Thank you, thank you for sharing. Let's continue with someone else. Diana, can you read number four? Do you hear me? Do you copy? <laughs> I'm gonna start. Very good. Let me see someone else. Uh, go, Melanie. Number four. Okay, teacher. Um, how many cell joysticks of water? Repeat it. How many sell you sticks of butter? 
No, no. How many está bien? How many? How many? Stick. Mean six. Porque está abajo, seis. How many six packs? No, no. El seis no va. It will be how many packs? How many packs of butter bars? Uh -huh. Of butter bar? Bars. Do you? También podría ser we. What? How many packs of butter, ba butter bars do you or do we need or want? We want six packs of butter bars. Okay. The last okay. one. The last one is Mael. Read the last one. Anna and Hugo. Um, how much water do Anna and Hugo need? Okay. How much water? Es la única con how much. Es la única. Entonces, how many? How much water do Anna and uh, Hugo need? Anna and Hugo need a lot of water. Okay, people, do you have any questions? You don't, okay. Teacher, in the sentence always um, carry the auxiliar, do and does. Not necessarily, it depends, depending. On how many, how much depending. Observe that. Quantos, how many? Came. How many came? Quantos vinieron? Sin sujeto y sin auxiliar. Es entendible. But it has to be, it has to be, uh, you have to get the reference, you know, the context of what you're talking about. Or, or for example, how many are going? Quantos irán? O quantos van? How many are going? Okay, so it is not really 100% uh, an obligation. I mean, the auxiliary. Do you have more questions? If you don't, it's okay. All right. Let's continue. Let's continue down here. On Tuesday, we practice with have to. And I was telling you the have to expresses obligations. Well, Personal obligations and personal necessities. Uh, it says here, ask two different partners about the activities that they that they have to do and don't have to do at their workplace. Okay, there you go. We're going to choose two people. No, we're gonna do, do it differently. People over here, choose, choose two friends, uh, family members, friends, people you know, okay? And we're going to write the name of the person he, over here, and we're going to write the person's obligations and the person's, uh, well, the ones that are not an obligation. Let me give you an example. Let me give you a for instance. Let me shoot here. Okay, Anna Osorio is my boss. He has to turn in documents every week. She has to turn in documents every week. Ella tiene que entregar documentos cada semana. Okay. That is her duty, her obligation, her responsibility. Su responsabilidad, su obligación, o su... su... Yeah. Responsibility. Things that she doesn't have to do. Cosas que no son su obligación. She doesn't have to clean the rooms. Okay, that's not her job. Okay, she doesn't have to clean the room. And that's what you're going to do. Easy people, really easy. Choose two friends, two family members, or two people that you know from your company or from uh, from anywhere. 
and uh, mention what the person has to do and mention what the person doesn't have to do. Okay, let's do that. I'm going to give you a couple of minutes, maybe three minutes. It's an easy activity. Go. I finish, teacher. Excellent. Uh, are two person, teacher or just one? Two persons. Two people is fine. What? Two people. Yes. Oh, oh okay. Sorry. Sorry. Chair, yes. Um, how do you say sacar in English? Oh, what? In what context? Um, for example, um, the trash. Oh, you can say take out. Take out. Take take out. Yeah. Take out. Okay. For the chef, you can say take. Take the trash out. Or you can say, take out the trash. Both are correct, no difference. Take the trash out or take out the trash. Or you can change trash, you can say garbage. Garbage. Right. Mm. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Yes. Okay, I think we are ready. Someone list us, people? Sure. Yes, Melanie. One example. Yeah, it's okay. One one example we have to, and one example we doesn't have to. Okay. Yes. Okay, let me see. Let's begin with you, Maya. Hello, hello, teacher. My example are the manager, the manager has to attend a meeting today. 
and the manager doesn't have to take inventory. Okay. And the next, Camila Alvarez. Camila has to go to university. Go to the university, okay. Camila doesn't have to go to work. Okay. Camila doesn't have to go to work. Okay. Yes, Mayra, thank you for your examples. Let's continue with another person. That person is, uh, well, Brian, are you there? I don't think he is. He isn't, okay. Ismael, you. Uh, one example. Yes. One person, okay. one person. One person. Um, Mayra. Mayra has to clean the office every day in the morning. And Mayra has sent to bring the stationery to the office. Repeat the second one, please. Um, Mayra has sent to bring the stationery to the office. Doesn't have to. Doesn't have to. Bring. No, no, but doesn't have to. Sería. Doesn't have to bring. Uh -huh. No, 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 no. Mayra has not. Has not. Hasn't. Mayra hasn't to bring. No, but it will be. Mayra ha it will has. Be, not Mayra to... doesn't. My, Mayra doesn't have to. Doesn't have. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mayra doesn't have to bring the stationery to the office. Station. Yeah. Okay. Stationery. Stationery. Okay. Stationary. Yes. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Ismael, for sharing. Jorge? One person, Jorge. Okay. Uh, about my kids, my sons. Okay. Okay, my sons have to go uh, to kindergarten every day. But they don't have to cook the lunch. Okay. Okay, that's okay. Good examples. They fit perfectly. Thank you, Jorge, for sharing. Let me try with Carlos. Carlos, go. Uh, I, uh, me, teacher? Yes, you. Choose one person. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, about my my work, uh, Emerson has to occupy the teleprompter every day. Uh, Emerson doesn't have to use the video camera. Okay. All right. We got it. We got it. You got it, Carlos. Victoria. Um, Sonia Salazar. Eh, uh, Sonia Salazar. Bueno, oh, she has to make tax return every month because they. She is the administrator. Mm -hmm. uh, she doesn't do work out office. He doesn't have to. She doesn't have to work out office. Out of the office. Out of the office. Out of. Okay, fantastic. Thank you. Let me continue, or let us continue with Sandra. Okay. Pane Ismael. Mm -hmm. Ismael designed the catastro plan and draw our um the service send week weekly report and use the plotter. Mm -hmm. And this is have to and don't have to, he don't drive, he does um, send invoice to the customer. Okay, he doesn't have to send. He doesn't have to send. He, he doesn't have to send invoice, invoice to the customer. Okay, invoices to customers. Okay. Yes. Let me see. Let me continue with Edith. 
Are you ready? Raquel is having uh, microphone problems today. Yancy? <clears throat> Hi. Hi. It's okay, don't worry. Well, well, Carlos, he has two report daily cell. He, he, he doesn't have to sell. Okay. He doesn't have to sell. All right. Very good. People, we have finished. We have... Uh, well, it is 10 o'clock already. Do you have any questions, guys? No, teacher, any questions? No questions, no questions? Okay. No. Uh, I just want to remind you of the activities that you have on the platform, that they are, they are pending. You have to complete them today, all right, if you can. Yes, it's the last day to, to update it. It's just the first, the first session or the first week, the first unit. Let me see if I can, if I have the. Okay, right here I can see who's worked and who hasn't. Can I actually can no? Okay, like here I have the information as you can see. All your names are there and everything you, all, all of it is there. Okay. And uh well, yeah, there are more people. Okay, thank you, people that uh that have worked on it. Yes, okay, yes. Remember, this has to be at least at least. 80 percent. You have to get at least 80 percent. Remember, you have to you have to uh, I mean you can do the activities uh one uh well many times. Many times you can do the activities many times, you can get 100. Okay, you can get 100. Now let me take attendance and after that we will be free to go. Except let me tell you who has to stay today. Yes. Who has to stay today? That person is Edith. Edith, hi. Hi. Yes. Usted se tiene que quedar ahora después, okay? Thank you. Present this Edith. Okay, thank you. Ana Victoria Galán. Yes, sir. Thank you. Uh, Melanie Portillo de Espinosa. Present teacher. Good night, everybody. Good night, good night. David uh, Ramirez Bernal. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto Orrego. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Eliezer Dimas. Denise Alejandra tampoco estuvo. Diana Yamilet Maravilla, she left. I don't know why. Edith Adilia. Hernández. Ismael Ernesto Boyat. Present teacher. Good night, everybody. Good night. Uh, Jorge Ernesto Hernández Durán. Present, present teacher. Thank you, Jorge. Mayra Elizabeth Lazo Escobar. Present teacher. Thank you, Rafael Alejandro Morales Ávila. Raquel Elizabeth de la Rosa Rodríguez. Yes, ahí está. Okay, thank you, thank you, Raquel. Sandra Ives Mendoza. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Sara Rachel. Salazar estuvo un buen, un buen rato y luego se marchó. Yancy Andrea. Solórzano. Present, teacher. Okay, there you go. We are fine. Okay. Thank you very much for this week. Gracias por esta semana. Por conectarte, por estar casi presente. I wish you the best. 
I wish you the best way, people. Descansen, vean películas, salgan con su familia, vayan a comer, descansen, okay. duerman, cualquier cosa que okay. pasen la vida, ¿ok? It's, 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 it's a order. Bye, teacher. Bye-bye. Hello, ladies. Hi. Hi. How are you? I fight, thank you. And you? Okay. I'm okay, I'm okay. Fantastic. <laughs> Ok, Edith, tenemos acá unos cuantos minutos para poder aclarar cualquier duda que usted pueda tener, complicación, confusión, uh, de alguna palabra, pronunciación, gramática, cualquier cosa, ¿ok? Dígame. Hello. Lo que siento que me costó bastante es como hacer, crear la pregunta cuando uno le dan la respuesta. La pregunta en qué parte, en qué parte dice. Mm, en todo. En todas las preguntas. Casi en todas las que más que todas las que vimos ahora, las que las que vimos ahora. Espérame, que no, no encuentro esta cosa. Aquí está. Yo lo voy a compartir a ver si es que es lo que usted dice. Espérame, quiero ver. Acá de comparto y Excuse me. I'm sorry. Ok, vamos a ver. Uh, sería la parte esta, ¿verdad? Tres. Sí, esa. Esta parte, ok. La respuesta, la pregunta... Ya que en este caso todas están en presente, ¿ok? Recordemos que en cualquier idioma, en todos los idiomas, hay diferentes uh, estructuras y tiempos, por decirlo así. Y todo lo que está acá está en presente, uh -huh. no hay ningún en pasado. Entonces, el auxiliar o los auxiliares que se usan en presente son dos. Se usa el do y el das. Solo esos dos se usan para el presente. Y aquí estamos en presente. Ahora... Para hacer la pregunta, vamos a usar how, usamos how many y usamos how much. Okay. Sí. La pregunta inicia con esos dos. How many significa cuántos o cuántas. How much es lo opuesto. No es lo opuesto, es solo uno. Cuánto o cuánta. Okay. Sí. La respuesta dice, I have 50 boxes of bread. Tengo, tengo 50 cajas de hilo. La pregunta debe decir cuántas cajas de hilos tienes, ¿sí? Sería, como digo, comenzamos con how many. How, how many, y luego usamos, después del how many, tenemos que usar la persona, el animal, la cosa o el lugar. El objeto, me refiero, el objeto o el lugar. En este caso, el objeto es la caja. Uh -huh. caja. Bueno, cajas de hilo. Todo eso es el objeto. Después de how many iría eso, cajas de hilo, boxes of bread. Okay. Ahí dice cuántas cajas de hilo. Hasta ahí estamos bien. Sí. Luego del objeto, de la persona, del animal o, o del lugar, usamos el auxiliar. En la respuesta tenemos I. El auxiliar que se usa con I es do. Okay, entonces pondremos acá how many boxes of thread do. Do. Y luego iría la persona. Okay. En este caso sería you. How many boxes of thread do you? Después del you iría el verbo. Have es el verbo en la respuesta. 
Y ahí concluye la pregunta. Y la pregunta dice, how many boxes of thread do you have? ¿Cuántas cajas de hilo tienes? Ese do no hace nada en la pregunta, solamente es un, es un auxiliar para que sea pregunta. ¿Okay? ¿Qué significa el do? Nada. En este caso no es nada. Solo es un auxiliar para representar la pregunta. Sin ese do, estaría incorrecto. ¿Ok? Estaría incorrecto. Usamos el do para mostrar o expresar que sí es una pregunta. Cambiémosle un poco acá la temática. Veamos aquí. Intentemos hacerlo. Borremos esto. Que está... No, ahí dejémoslo. Está bien. Vamos acá. La Pondré una respuesta y usted me entenderá también la pregunta. Ok, veamos. Sí. She is okay. Observe la pregunta. Ella come cuatro pizzas. Sencilla la, 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 el ejemplo, la respuesta, perdón. She, mm -hmm. eats, she eats four pizzas. ¿Cómo sería la pregunta? Tendría que ser la pregunta: ¿Cuántas pizzas come ella? Ahora, ¿cómo la formularía usted esa pregunta? ¿Cómo lo haría? De acuerdo a lo que vimos anteriormente. ¿Cómo se inicia? How do you begin the question? Permítame, es que fíjese que me está fallando el teléfono. Y se ha quedado, solo escucha la voz y no veo nada. ¿No se mira? ¿Yo lo comparto? No, es que la pantalla está fallando ahorita. Pero permítame. O sea que, vaya, bueno, ahorita sí. Que por ratito se queda así como negro, no se ve nada. Sí, usualmente es un error que da, que da Zoom. A veces se lo, lo, lo saca uno de la, de la sesión. Uh, cuando, más que todo cuando comparto pantalla, cuando comparte pantalla el, el anfitrión, comparte pantalla muchos, muchos, algunos, dos o tres, a veces se van o se retiran. No es porque quieren, es porque la, la opción de compartir pantalla, compartir el anfitrión, hace que ellos se salgan. Automáticamente es un error de Zoom. He colocado acá el ejemplo que dice, ella come cuatro pizzas. La pregunta sería, ¿cuántas pizzas come ella? ¿Cómo inicia la pregunta usted? Edith, ¿me escucha? Hello. Hello, 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 Hola, ahora sí. Okay. Hola. Ya. Yeah. <ríe> ¿Y qué me... Uh -huh. ¿Lo puedes ver ahora? Va. Sí, ahorita sí estoy viendo la pantalla. Ok, muy bien. Let's go, Va, vamos a ver. Pero lo que me sale no es lo que estábamos viendo, sino que me sale otra cosa. ¿Qué le sale? Ah, bueno. Ahorita sí. Lo de las pizzas, ¿verdad? Ah, oh, yes, yes. Sí. Bueno, la pregunta era. En este caso sería cuántas, porque estamos con ese tema. ¿Cuántas y cuánto? Sería cuántas pizzas come ella. How, how many. Ajá, así comienza, cabal. Así Ajá. Como... How many? How many pizzas? Exactly, exactly. Mm -hmm. How many pizzas? We cheat. Okay, she eat. eats. Falta, falta lo más esencial en este caso, okay, que es lo cual es el auxiliar. No olvide el auxiliar. Usamos dos auxiliares, usamos el do y el das. Para I, you, we y they, usamos el do. Para she, he, and it, usamos el das. O el, se escribe do es, se pronuncia das. Ok, so, sería acá, how many, how mm. many pizzas? Das she. Ajá, das she. Y así es como es la pregunta. 
-huh. Es básicamente lo mismo que está abajo. La única diferencia, o sí, sí, diferencia, es que hemos agregado el DAS en la respuesta. Perdón, en la pregunta. En la pregunta. Ajá, lo demás ahí está. Aquí está pizzas y aquí está she eats. Ok, son el orden, es que hay, que hay que ver cómo va el orden. El en el principio, luego el objeto, luego el auxiliar, la persona, y por último iría el verbo. Así, ok. Veamos, intentemos uno con how much. Mucho borro todo. It's ok, it's ok. Pongamos acá. I. I collect this. I collect five bucks every day. Colecciono o colecto cuatro dólares todos los días. ¿Cómo sería la pregunta? Sería cuántos dólares coleccionas o colectas al día. Okay, otro How dólar. much? No, no. Listen, listen. No lo puse con how much acá. Listen, listen. ¿Cuántos dólares colectas al día? How many? Uh -huh. How many? How many dollars? Ok. También se puede usar bucks. Esa que está aquí. B-U-C-K-S. También significa dólares. Pero no dice bucks. Four bucks. Four bucks. Mm -hmm. Ok. Sería how many, how many bucks? Eh, colleagues. Recuerda, do you call it? Do, el auxiliar. Ok, después del sí. objeto. El auxiliar, do you call it? Ajá, el, do you call it, exactly. Do you call it? How many bucks? Every do day. You, ajá, exactly, every day. Es faltaba, sorry. Every day. How many bucks do you collect every day? Let's try with another example. Let me put this one. I put... I get very, I get very little gasoline. Consigo muy, well, poquita. Consigo poquita gasolina. ¿Cómo sería la pregunta? Edith. How many? Yes. How much? Okay. Recuerde, how many is plural. De dos para arriba. El how much se queda solamente con uno, porque es imposible contarlo. No se puede contar la gasolina, ¿ok? Sería how much. Mm -hmm. Es el mismo, mismo, much? Orden, mismo orden de how many. La diferencia es que usamos el much en vez de la, el many. Digamos, how much? Hi, ma, how much gasoline? Mm -hmm. Gasoline. How much gasoline? Do you, how much gasolina do you? Do you get? ¿Cuánta gasolina consigues? How much gasoline do you get? I do get, get very little gasoline. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. What you have to do is this is practice. Tienes que practicar mucho las preguntas. Uh, ¿Cómo le podría yes. explicar acá? Hay preguntas que no contienen auxiliares y hay preguntas que, que sí o sí hay que usar el auxiliar. Déjeme le muestro una pregunta uh -huh. que no requiere auxiliar. Esta pregunta no tiene auxiliar. No, pongámosle who, who came, ¿Quién, vi? quién vino. Ahí dice quién vino. Who came? Ese who es, una, es para pregunta. El came es un verbo uh -huh. que significa vino, en pasado. Come es presente. 
y tiene un signo de pregunta, ¿por qué? No tiene auxiliar nada, ¿verdad? Okay, hay preguntas que no tienen auxiliar, no llevan auxiliar, se llaman fragmentos, fragmentos, o preguntas incompletas. Pero las preguntas, la mayoría de preguntas, todas, todas las preguntas llevan auxiliar. Okay? So we need the auxiliary. More questions, más preguntas tiene Edith. Uh, no. Okay. Solamente. Yes, dígame. Solamente le digo. Okay. Okay. Do you have do you have any recommendations to improve the classes or the sessions? Yes. Okay. What is your recommendation? Uh, I not un I not understand. Oh, I'm asking you. Uh, do you have do you have any recommendations for me? Uh, no. No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Entonces hemos concluido. Gracias por quedarse. Miren, nos quedamos mucho más del, del tiempo que debería quedar. Lo siento mucho. Vamos a quitar el okay. tiempo. Okay. Gracias. Que descanse. Gracias mucho. <laughs> Perdón. Que descanse. Cuídense mucho. Okay. Nos vemos el lunes. Okay. Okay. Bye. Good morning.